Immunization in infancy and early childhood is really important because it's a method of protecting children at their most vulnerable time to those vaccine-preventable diseases. Pneumococcus, as an example, is a bacterial infection that's very common. About a third of children who have pneumococcal meningitis will go on to have permanent hearing loss later on, as well as other neurological complications. The vaccine schedule is designed to protect children when they're most at risk for those particular infections. And so a delay or a, or a gap actually leaves them the most vulnerable at the time that they're most at risk. The pandemic has caused problems with childhood immunization rates. If you were isolating at home and you missed an appointment, there certainly may have been fewer appointments available. We've observed decreases in immunization rates for important routine immunizations. As we decrease immunization rates, then the likelihood that that infection is going to return to a community and establish itself goes up. I'm a parent with three of my own children. We, as a family, received a notice from our public health unit that one of our children had missed one of their routine immunizations, and we were able to schedule an appointment with our family doctor to have our child caught up. The track record of routine childhood immunizations is that they're very safe. For children or infants who have missed immunizations, there are recommended catch-up schedules. The best time to, to receive an immunization is as per the, the schedule. The next best time is now. Parents can be proactive about catching up on missed immunizations just by talking to their family doctor or by contacting their local immunization clinic. It's just about calling them up and saying, I think my child needs some routine immunizations, I think they need to be caught up. Thank you.